Extreme prematurity. Birth before 28 weeks is a global health concern affecting nearly a million babies each year. One important and common complication is retinopathy of prematurity, ROP. To better understand the role IGF-1 plays in ROP, it's helpful to take a quick look at what happens during normal retinal vascular development in utero. First, we see the development of the vascular structure. Then the retinal vasculature is laid down, starting at the optic nerve and radiating outward as new vessels bud from existing ones. Importantly, this angiogenesis is stimulated by physiologic hypoxia, as metabolic demand exceeds current oxygen supply. Hypoxia-stimulated growth factors are secreted by the avascular retina in order to stimulate new vessel formation. IGF-1 is critical for normal fetal retinal development. In the third trimester, a threshold level of IGF-1 is present, allowing for vascular endothelial growth factor, or VEGF, to drive angiogenesis.